Hi, my YouTube people. I am. I am doing this video for my YouTube people to review this book. To tell you, because I finished it last night. It is an awesome read. Whether you agree with his lifestyle, whether you like him at all, whether or not you can stand him or not. This is a good read. I, To be honest, I am a fan of his. Uh, and some of my followers I know are... I'm Christian too, and some people will say, No, you're not if you, you uh, support him. Just do you. Do you. Um, I may not... I could understand those beliefs, and I could understand all that stuff. I am the more the type, like, I don't like it being shoved down my throat. If you want to live that way, do you. What more than do you. But I don't like it being shoved down my throat. And I don't like that schools think it's it's their right to teach our kids about stuff we don't want them to, to learn about. Now, me personally, my husband doesn't want them, if we have kids, she, he doesn't want the school to teach them about that. I... On the other hand, I don't want them, depending on the um, content. So I'd, I'd really have to ask the teacher the content of what they're going to be teaching before I decide. And if they don't want to tell me it, then yeah, no. If you're not going to tell me it, then no. Because uh, I don't care if a teacher says something, because what happened, when it comes down to it, what the parents say is the final word. Teachers can say all they want, but they don't have the final say. Even if they think they have the final say, they don't have the final say. But back to that. He, this is a great book. He is fighting for what America was built on. He is fighting for... And I know a lot of followers who just recently started following me are anti-capitalism. Well, you know what? I don't care. I am for capitalism because that's the only way this country is going to work. Sorry. Socialism isn't going to work. Communism isn't going to work. Alright. Life isn't fair. Plain and simple. Life is not fair. There's going to be no dis redistributing of wealth. Quit trying to live in that fairy tale. And it has nothing to do with people being more privileged than others. And you could freaking unfollow me, get mad at me, whatever you want. I don't care. I don't care. Uh, there are people who are less fortunate. That is true. There are people who are less fortunate. But this book is promoting free speech, freedom of expression, all the Bill of Rights, the the uh, Constitution. And I know there's a lot of people of, who uh, are anti-Constitution. You know what? I am going to protect the Constitution forever. I don't, I don't care. I still love everybody, um, no matter who you are, no matter what you look like, no matter what your race is. And you could, you could disagree with me there. I don't care. But, um... This has taught me a lot. This has taught me don't let go to don't let go of who you are because other people are jealous. Don't let go of who you are because other other people want what you have or feel entitled to what you have or think they worked so you could have what you have. I worked to get everything I have. Nobody else did that for me. Nobody else did that for me. Not a other group of people did that for me. They could argue that I got my stuff because of their blood, sweat, and tears. That is not true. I did it by myself. I did it myself. Okay? I have no guilt at all. I never did anything bad to anybody. And if I did feel guilty for the moment, I apologize to those people that I feel like I wronged. So it says I have no guilt. You don't have to agree with that. That's fine. But I'm not changing me because of un uptight individuals. So, this is beautiful. This is a great book. A great read. There is a part of this book that talks about Emory University. Where... They 
the the anti the left people who were anti Milo were came come to protest, and that that university basically said we're gonna let him come here. You, you can't silence free speech. Uh, and after his little thing, he went outside with some chalk, handed people chalk, and they wrote. Some wrote F Milo, some wrote F Trump, others wrote Trump, uh, Trump, you know, pro Trump, you know, we love Milo. Some wrote um, any all their messages. There was a multitude of different views, and that was a beautiful moment I read in that book because that proves a lot that some of the vloggers I listened to wrong. We can all come together. We can all come together. I'm gonna repeat that. We can all come together. Now, if you want to work on your community first, you do that. You do that. Because it may make it stronger to come together. So, like I said, a great read. Read it. Because one, they may ban it because it's part of the ban. It's books that people want banned. It's, it's. Freedom of speech that they want banned. So, read it while you can. Much love.